वेलकम टू द पार्ट नाइन ऑफ द चैप्टर नाइन यूजिंग इमेजेस लिस्ट इमेजेस एंड लिंक्स इन दिस पार्ट नाइन स्टूडेंट्स वी आर गोइंग टू स्टडी यूजिंग इमेजेस एज अ बैकग्राउंड ओके यूजिंग इमेज एज अ बैकग्राउंड टू द वेब पेज सो लेट इज क्विकली बिगिन विद इट स्टूडेंट्स नाउ वी कैन यूज एनी इमेज फाइल एज अ बैकग्राउंड फॉर द वेब पेज what is the meaning of this students so whenever you open any web page for example last time you created some web pages right we created web pages like this okay like this now see if you can see the background of this web page is this white color yes this is the default background okay this is the default background of this web page but you had seen that you can change the color of this background by using the bg color attribute of the body tag okay you have seen that how to change the color of the body okay how to change the color of this background of this page but what you have not studied is how to use a image as the background okay for example if you look over here see this web page on this web page instead of color this there is a image that has been used as a background to this web page okay so let us see how to perform this action okay so we can use any image file as a background for our web page this can be achieved by using the background attribute of the body tag so now we are going to learn an additional attribute of the body tag okay B body tag okay so look at this example they have started with html okay this is the html tag then the head tag title tag inside the head tag there is title tag then they have written using background image the title okay then they have closed the title then this is the head tag this they have closed the head tag okay then they have opened the body tag okay now this is the body tag and students this is the top margin attribute of the body tag which you have studied in class 6 okay so top margin they have given 100 and then this is the background attribute that we are talking about background okay so what is the name of the attribute background and this, then the value of this background will be the name or the location of this picture or the image okay so if the name of this image is seen dot jpg then you close the body attribute and then you write anything in the inside the body okay what they have written they have written a beautiful scenery on the body of the page okay then they have closed the font tag then they have closed the body tag and then they have closed the html tag and in this simple manner you can upload a image as the background of your web page let us practically do this okay so students i have this scenery okay i have this scenery image on my this folder okay in my this folder i have this image so what let us create a web page and uh, use this scenery dot uh, jpg as the background of that web page okay so i have this small code i will just delete everything okay so i will write image as background okay now see i have started with html tag then head tag title on in and this is title of between title on and title off i have written some title which will appear on the title bar of the page okay in the output then this is the head of tag okay after the head of tag i get the body tag students now if i want to upload an image as a background of a web page then i have to use the background attribute of the image tag background okay don't write background okay don't make spelling mistake okay it is background b a c k g r o u n d okay and over here i need to specify the location of my image so you know what we need to do we need to 
just uh, go to properties of this image go to security and copy the location of this image okay copy the location of this image and then paste it inside the value of the background attribute okay and then if you want to write something in the body suppose i am writing image as background you can write anything okay even if you don't write anything it will be shown as blank only okay so it doesn't matter what the main topic is this okay then you close the body tag and then you close the html tag and then you save this file save as this file suppose background dot html okay so give some name to it you can give any name and then with the dot uh, html and now you save this file over here so now you see students this is the file that i have created this is the html file that i have created now when i open this file you can see my uh, this web page has a background of this image yes or no this was that image and now my html page has this same background okay so i hope uh, this is a very easy topic and you have understood this topic if you have any doubts you can ask me in the comment section thank you for listening take care of yourself and be well